my favorite gas station to get go. And I went in and purchased me one lottery ticket. This one's three dollars. Yeah, a lottery ticket. This one's three dollars because I played the extra, it's called Mega Player. And I normally just play one number, and this is what the play slip was like. I think the lottery is 192 million. Yeah, today it's 192 million. So this actually the drawing is tomorrow. So wish me luck. Now we're heading over here to uh, TJ Maxx to get some luggage. Now if we're gonna get a big one like this and like a three set. Luggage, what would you get? What brand would you get? What size would you get? What kind would you get? Would you get one that seals up like that? Or would you get like the cloth kind, like this? So, what would y'all get? Let me know. Put it in the comments down there. Yeah, I kind of like this one. on the tomato plant the leaves are broke off but there's something else eating it too so let's see ah there's a caterpillar see that that's eating it and that's from those um, I believe those white butterflies there's one, there's probably another one in here. Oh, there's a little tomato. Oh, there's a big one. Look at here. Look at that monster. Right there. Yeah, now I need to spray the neem oil spray, which I haven't been using. It's eating the plant. And the bird was eating it. I gotta do something about that. There's some beans here. We can pull those. Yeah, once you start pulling this stuff, it'll start growing more. Look at that. Some beans all through there. And then over here. Pairs and see how they're doing. Yep, they're filling in. I can't wait till these get big. I was curious on what these are gonna taste like. No, oh, a lot of these have a hole on it. I don't know if there's an insect inside those or not. So if there's anyone that's watching this, it's a gardener, and you know anything about pears, let me know what this is in the comment section. Okay. I'm going to Finished cutting the yard because it's very cool out here. Look like it's gonna rain so Let's see what the yard look like first. See that? It's not bad at all. Another thing, we're gonna talk about pros and cons of living in a subdivision. Because if you can see my grass, the state that it's in, it's not long at all. It's probably, I don't know, maybe four or five inches long. We got a notice from the homeowners association saying that we need to cut our grass and we had tall weeds, which is not bad. I mean, look. There's nothing. There were some weeds out by the mailbox, but that's it. That'll be my next uh, vlog. It'll be about pros and cons of living in a subdivision. So look out for that. 
Okay, I'm gonna get started on this and we'll see the finished results. Okay, the yard is done. It's still cool out here, but I'm sweating. 